Welcome back, everybody. It's Jeff. And Christina. With J&K Stay in Vegas with another Where's My Coffee? Where's My Room? No, it's Where's My Coffee. Oh, your coffee? My coffee. Oh, okay. Her coffee. Where's My Room for a brand new summer 2020. No, it's not summer. With a brand new winter 2023 full tour of the win here in Las Vegas. What are you laughing about? The people watching us. They can't see the people behind the camera. You know, you've got hot coffee in there. Yeah, I do. You got hot coffee in there. Why do you do that all the time? Why is, why's she going to blow it? We've got hot coffee in there. We're going to take you on a full tour here at the Win for 2023. See what's new. And speaking of new, what is new? Oh, the Awakening Show The awake, Win. The Awakening Show. We're going to show you where that is in here and anything else that has changed all the restaurants and everything new here at the Win for 2023. All right, let's get in there and... Go! Everybody, we're gonna start here from this main valet drop-off entrance here at the Win and head inside for a full tour of the Win for 2023. In this beautiful area here, we're going to look at more detail coming up later. But we turn to our right here, and we can see this beautiful sculpture that we'll look at in a few minutes. Smiling King Bear. But right here, directional signage here. Keeping to our right, it's a self-check-in and intrigue. This was a nightclub here at the Wynn. It is no longer, it is permanently closed, but Mizumi down here, sashimi, sushi, and all that is down here. And that's pretty much, it's all down in this right-hand side, down in this wing. You can see the front drop-off is just right over there as well. But let's continue on over here. See resort elevator showroom signage there. We'll see that later in the video. And again, we'll check out this beautiful middle part here a little bit later, but we're gonna keep on our right-hand side and you can see registration for hotel registration is just over here. And what's really cool is that they've got the uh, view, the waterfall over here. And to get an even better view, you come down here to the SW Lakeside restaurants, but turn to your right here for special North Show Terrace overlooking the Lake of Dreams. It's a little bar area over to the right-hand side. Did you know that this is over here? Check this out. The terrace up here. Don't even need to go to the expensive aft cocktail bar, which is down there. A nice look here at the waterfall. Get a nice picture like those girls are doing down there. Let's head back inside. So coming out of the North Show Terrace overlooking the Lake of Dreams. Here is this beautiful area. You've probably seen in many videos of the Lakeside Restaurant, of course, Bar Parasol and the SW Steakhouse. Get a better look straight ahead at the Aft Cocktail Bar. This opened in April of 2022. Did a quick video on that. Check that out on our TikTok and Instagram. All right, so Lake of Dreams right behind us, SW Steakhouse, Lakeside Aft Cocktail Lounge. All that fun here at the Wynn. We did a Lake of Dreams video here. I was here. gonna say, we did Lake of Dreams, like dinner, the show, everything, it was great. So. SW Steakhouse is the bomb. You definitely have to try it out. And we have the video. Yep. So go find it. Yeah, dinner our video. And show. Yes, SW Steakhouse and Lake of Dreams is on our channel. We'll leave a link right up there mm -hmm. in the top right of the corner of the screen so you can go check it out after this video, of course. All right, let's keep going on with the video. So let's continue on down over here to the Esplanade shops down here. Wynn has a lot of the high-end shop. Again, we'll take a look at the cute carousel and all the flowers and it is the year of the rabbit. Incorporate that as well. So the Esplanade shops, I'm just gonna take you through real quick, speed up the footage, and I'll show you where this exit leads out here at the Wynn. So this right here is where this door lets out, right in front of the lake, right here in front of the Wynn. And uh, see Treasure Island across the way. But a good photo op spot where you probably just saw our intro here at the Wynn right by the Lake of Dreams. So let's continue on with the tour here at the Wynn, Las Vegas.
Okay, back to where we were. SW and Lakeside restaurants are down there. And of course, the uh, beautiful flower carousel here. I don't know what they exactly they call this area. I've tried to look it up. If you know the exact name of this area, let us know in the comments below. But we'll go through that later on in the video. Let's keep heading over to our right over here. Let's see a lot of the machines over here. Keep down to our right hand side. We'll eventually be hitting the tower suites. That's a completely separate area of property. High limit slots over here. Here is Red 8 over here. All right, so straight ahead is the tower suites and Tableau is over here. We're gonna keep on our right hand side, go down here. Now Tableau is a place where you can get coffee first thing in the morning. But they're only open till 2.30. But before we do, I'm going to keep on the right-hand side. Check out the special entrance for the tower suites. And the villas are out on this side here. Pretty cool. People getting married, don't want to interrupt them. Let's head back inside. Tower suite registration is just over here. And Tableau restaurant. There's a little bit on offering right there. But we'll continue down here on our right-hand side. So Wing Lei is down here. And then straight ahead, Delilah. Just as of note, they do not allow cameras or anything to do with Instagram or anything inside for, as they say, discretion. So keep that in mind if you wanna do some uh, Instagram photos and stuff. Delilah does not allow it. So down here, the wedding salons and convention area, and we're not gonna go all the way down there, but I will tell you something that you should know. So just down over here, you can go down through the convention area and you can get a great look at the pool, the Encore nightclub pool, also the promenade, which overlooks the wind golf course. So some great views down there. So this will eventually loop around like the Bellagio does to all the way down to the wind buffet. But um, we're gonna keep going on the tour and I'll show you that in just a few moments. All right, let's keep going on with the tour, turn around and keep on our right hand side hey folks if you're enjoying this video so far please hit that subscribe button and hit that thumbs up and to turn on those bell notifications ding, to, be, ding, ding. to be alerted to every time we post a new video or go live all right let's keep on with the video all right so then delilah here on the right hand side again here is tableau place to get coffee and then of course your tower suite registration and elevators are just over here so let's continue down here on the right hand side just a glance this is where we came from there on the left so we'll just keep going down here keep on this right hand side to keep your bearings straight and everything because that's what we do so then we come up to this another little intersection here we're going to turn to our right first Again, keeping on the right, one of the most popular places probably here on Wynn property is the Wynn Buffet. Well guys, right behind us is the Wynn Buffet. We did one of our first videos here at the Wynn Buffet and we need to go and visit this it's again. It's the day that it opened. Yeah, the day it reopened back reopened. in the situation. So Yeah. And we're going to be here in 2023 to check out the Wynn Buffet. Exactly. Hopefully this month in January 2023. Stay tuned and subscribe to our channel because we will be doing yes. a Wynn Buffet video. So. Wait for that, check it out in the future on our channel. Quick run down here, show you where this is. The cave is right here, food and wine. Tell you about that here. There's a look at their offerings right here. And then right next to that is the Terrace Point Cafe. So guys, another place that you can get coffee in the morning from 7 a.m. is the Terrace Point Cafe. This is just down here from the Wind Buffet. So if you need some coffee in the morning, you can definitely get it here, right? Yes. But they're only open till three o'clock in the afternoon. So just keep that in mind. There's no late coffee. You gotta go over to Cafe Al. Riato. That place. Was that right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Cafe Al Triato. Oh my God. So again, yeah, uh, the Terrace Point Cafe is only open until three o'clock, but another place to get coffee first thing in the morning. Yes. So if you're playing golf, you've got a golf package. The Wynn Golf Club South Villas are down here and the Encore Fairway Villas are down here. Villas, whichever you want. And then I told you about that it'll loop right around. So that is over here. So if you loop back from the convention area and go to the promenade and see those views of the pool, it'll take you back around here to this hallway where 
the wind buffet is here at the end. Let's speed through this till we get up here to the drugstore. So if you just need something quick to go, there is the drugstore, kind of uh, nice and different sounding than the typical essentials or whatever, but you can get a quick drink or some souvenirs and all that stuff. So that is right here. It's called the drugstore. And there's La Cave again, food and wine hideaway. Check out these cars here. McLaren Formula One is coming here to Vegas, November 2023. Again, Wind Buffet right over here on the right hand side. Right over here is the elevators to resort pool, spa, and salon. So I know some people have asked about where the spa and the salon is. Right over there. Pool is currently closed like a lot of properties here in Vegas during the winter. So just keep that in mind. Pools are not open all year round. There are a few, but this is not one of them. All right, here's our intersection we just came from over there on our left. Where we came from, we're going to continue on our right-hand side. I thought that was a real doggy. They got Allegro over there. Wood fried pizzas. Got my name written all over it. And then continuing on our right-hand side. And this is the new place. Awakening. The Awakening Theater. And over here, Cafe Al Teatro. This is open 24 hours. So they got ice cream, coffee, whole bunch of stuff. So guys, if you want to get coffee, uh, kind of close to your resort room, not really close to the tower suites, but right behind us is... Cafe Al Teatro. That place. You know how well I pronounce things. <laughs> it's this, not even a problem for me. <laughs> this is all day service, 24 seven. So if you need some coffee, at any time of the day for that matter. Come check out Cafe Teatro. So they have the restaurant, the little restaurant in there, but they have the little pickup window on the outside here. So you can actually just uh, order it there or pick it up by uh, the app, I believe it is. Call it in. Everybody but, does mobile pickup order apps, yeah, so I'm you should be used to that. Call it in yeah. and uh, come down and pick it up and they'll have it ready for you. Yeah, so Cafe El Teatro. 24-7 here at the Wynn. <laughs> Awakening is the newest offering, opened in November of 2022. And then the Encore Theater is right next door. So Awakening right behind us, it's got two shows nightly, 7 p.m. and 9.30 p.m. Monday is a dark day, mm -hmm. but uh, we need to go see this show. We totally need to go see this show because now they're doing rehearsals back here. Well, they just stopped right now, but it sounds really cool, yeah, actually. Yeah, we've so. seen some pictures and video online. So mm -hmm. next time you're here at the Wynn in Las Vegas or just visiting Vegas, come see this show and let us know if you've seen it already. We need to go see it, so. Yeah. Let us know. Now, Encore is going to be a completely separate video. Even though Excess is part of Wynn, that is down this hallway. So Excess Win is down this Encore hallway. Of course, they're very sister properties. And uh, so that's where that is. So it can get confusing. So like some of our other bigger property tours, you may have to watch this a couple of times to uh, kind of get all your bearings. But that's why I keep to the right-hand side. So that way it... Uh, isn't confusing. So let's head to our right down here. Wynn Plaza Shops, it says right there. Again, wind parking is still free here, so that's good news. So here's your self park right over here. Down here is where the Wynn Plaza Shops are. See that signage? Love all the cool art decorations down here. Right down at the end is also the exit out to the Las Vegas Strip. The other one you can see there lets you out there kind of just down the street from Resorts World and that empty area that used to be the new frontier. But that is uh, still TBD for the future. So Earth Cafe down here in the Plaza Shops of the Wynn is another place to get coffee, although a little bit further than uh, all of the rest of your rooms, but it's a good place to check out. Open 7.30 a.m. Sunday through Thursday, mm -hmm. and open till seven o'clock at night, and then on the weekends, open till nine o'clock at night, right? You got that down. Yeah, <laughs> and there's also another location in the southwest part of the valley over by the Durango Casino. Yes, and the as uncommons. Of, yes, and also guys, if you haven't seen any Starbucks here in the video so far, it's because there's no Starbucks on but property here none, at the Wynn. So you got to get some original coffee from one of the original places and here. And it's um, really good though. Yeah, yeah. So uh, no Starbucks. So if you need that uh, typical Starbucks fix, you're not going to find it here at the <laughs> Wynn. All right, let's turn around and keep continuing our tour here at the Wynn. And then here is Allegro. 
Again, with their wood fire pizzas and some cocktail areas. Open dinner nightly from 5 p.m. Cool spot in there. Definitely a good place to unwind. Then come up here on the right is the race and sports book. So it's very expansive. LED displays and everything else. Nice bar right next to it. It's called Charlie's Bar. Charlie's Bar is um, a good place to sit if you don't want to sit in the racing sports book. Let's see Charlie's right in here. So come and take a look at that. So you still got one more thing to do is check out these beautiful flowers in this middle area and see what we can see. So keeping on our right, there's the bell desk. This is where we started, right here. So let's get some great shots and video of this over here. Great picture spot is, as you can see with everybody, it is the year of the rabbit and Bellagio is doing that all up on their conservatory, but wind does not want to be left out. So they got their thing going on here and over here, saw a brief look at it but this over here this big guy right here oh yeah he's cute he is the smiling king bear of spain 2017 fiberglass stainless steel structure and painted enamel but let's walk through here look at all these bunny rabbits everywhere even this one has a cardinal on it Oh, look at these two little bunnies kissing. And then this beautiful foliage and everything still extends on the other side of the bar here. More little bunny rabbits over here. There's the main part of the casino. Tons of table games and casino slot machines. And still checking out these cute little bunnies. They are everywhere. Beautiful flower painting ornaments up here, whatever you call them. But everybody loves this carousel, so beautiful. And then right down there is where we were, the Esplanade shops right down there. All right, let me go grab Christina and finish up the video. We hope you've enjoyed this full tour look at the win. Awakening, very new, very cool. Very exciting. And now you know where that is. Lionel Richie's coming here. Brian Adams is coming. The Plaza Shops, always something to eat there with all those new restaurants. Yes. Allegro, a whole bunch of different spots. And of course, Lake of Dreams, which we did back in 2020. Go check out that video as yeah, well. Go check that out. Lake that, was of a, that was a really, really fun experience at SW Steakhouse. So, Go check that out on their channel. If you enjoyed this video and you found it useful, please hit that thumbs up. And she's trying to do a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe and turn on those bell notifications to be alerted to every time we post a new video just like this or we go live like on Saturday nights, right? Yeah, you do. All right. Thanks everybody for watching. Until next time, stay safe. And stay silly. Bye-bye everybody. Bye.